In this video, I'm going to show you how you can disable Cortana on your Windows 10 computer. First of all, you need to find out which version of Windows 10 you have. And we can easily do that by doing a right click on the start button and then going to system. It will scroll down. You can see that I have Windows 10 Pro. So I'm going to show you how to do it both on the Pro and Enterprise versions and also the Home Edition. Let's first do the Pro because that's the one I have. So you can do with your keyboard Windows R to open the run or you can just do run. Same thing. And we're going to type GP edit that MSC. But before we go here, I want to make sure that you know what we're doing. We're going to access the registry of your Windows operating system, which is very sensitive. If you change something that you're not very sure about it, it's very likely that you can screw things up. So if you've never accessed the registry before, just do it at your own peril. Okay. So we're going to access the registry, click OK. So here in the group registry, we're going to go, let me just span this here real quick. We're going to go to computer configuration and then administrative templates, double click, then windows components, double click. And then here we're going to look for search. I'm just going to span here, scroll to search. Here we go. Here we have search. So on this allow Cortana, we're going to right click and hit edit. So again, make sure that you have allow Cortana. And then from not configured, you're going to change it to disabled. We're going to hit apply and OK. So that disables Cortana. As you can see in the description, if you enable or don't configure this setting, Cortana will be allowed on the device. If you disable this setting, Cortana will be turned off. So that's what we did. So we want to get it removed from everywhere else. So as you can see, it disappeared from my taskbar. And if I right click, you can notice that it does not show Cortana anymore. So now for the home edition, what you will do will be the same place, control R to open run. And we're going to go to the registry again. So this time will be REG edit and hit OK. Hit yes. So let's follow this path. It will be local machine. We're going to expand it. Then let's go to software. And let's go to policies, policies, and then Microsoft, and then ooh, let's span this here, Windows. And here under Windows, you should have Windows Search. Here we go, Windows Search. So I do have Windows Search, but some of you might not have Windows Search. If you don't have Windows Search, then you click here where it says Window. Just make sure that you have it selected, right? And then you right click on this area and then click new and you would like to create a new key. So you click that and then you will name it Windows Search. I already have Windows Search, so I just don't want to mess anything up. So I'm going to name it number two, but you will just name it Windows Search. OK, so once you are on your Windows Search, which will be like this empty, we want to make it look like this, right? So we're going to select the window search that we just created and we're going to right click again and then click new. And this time we want to create a D word 32 bit value. So we have new value one. We want to rename it. Allow Cortana. I'm just going to name it two to differentiate because I don't want to mess things, but you should name it just allow Cortana, just like we have it here, right? So then you want to modify and make sure that you have a zero because in computer stuff zero is false and one is true so you want to make sure that you have zero which means basically disabled and that will do the trick with that registry there you should be able to disable cortana from your computer so hopefully you found this video helpful and if you did please leave a like and subscribe to the channel have a wonderful rest of the day my friends and stay safe out there